at the moment we're using Inventor. It just makes it a lot easier being able to print things out and the fact that we learned how to use CAD last semester as well really helps this semester. Because um, we can just go in, it took us a couple of days to do all this for naval architecture. It'd be something I'll be using a fair bit throughout my career. It's just the fact that AMC teaches it, it's really helpful. It'll definitely help uh, if it's on your resume. This boat here is our rat trap boat. This is the first year project that we did for Dynamics. We're given a rat trap, and this is the only material that we've been given. And we've got to make a boat go 10 metres in the fastest possible time. So the thing about AMC, right, we get a lot of hands-on practical, so where we can actually work on stuff instead of just studying on them. I feel, I feel that this is, uh, this is a good experience for me because it really helps us in our studies, not only with our works and also our practicals. I think yeah, that's, that's a good experience for me. We aren't allowed exotic materials like carbon fibre or graphite or anything like that. Um, there's a length restriction of one metre, a width restriction of half a metre and a height of half a metre also. Also, there's a minimum weight of a kilo. Coming away from this, we'll be able to know what doesn't work, what will work and we can apply that in a career situation. It's a really interesting project that's good because the rat trap is a simple way of powering the boat. It's not like a motor or something electric where there's a lot more to kind of think about this. We really get to focus on the design of the boat and the forces involved rather than messing around with electrical stuff. They are able to apply themselves to a problem of unknown. So whatever they learn in theory, they should be able to apply to practical side. Engineers are all about teamwork. If you can't re really work in team, you can't be a good engineer. So at this stage, like from very first semester, very first year, we are working in teams. We are getting to know other people. And teamwork, I really prefer teamwork because we have one problem and there would be five, six mind working on it, uh, rather than working one person working on one problem. Some projects might have more of a direct correlation between what you learn in class and what you do in a lab, like say lab reports, but this is more kind of actually applied to specific problems, like you have a boat and you need to you know, propel a boat. So it's been really good that you know, we get the design experience and the building experience as well as actually applying it to our knowledge that we're learning in class. My distinction for that for the boat is 10 metres in under 30 seconds. So it's, it's faster than you think. We're getting there, we're getting there, it's coming together. We're thinking of ways to reduce our red trap board to the, uh, try to minimise its friction so yeah. it can move the fastest. Yeah, and then and then for the propeller, we try to increase its its yeah. performance. So yeah, I think we we might win this. Made about seven meters, so ideally we have to go ten. So there's some modifications. We're making the middle axle a bit smaller, so it has a smaller turning circle, so it's going to go a bit slower. So the rack track will now last longer. You probably back yourself a bit more now, knowing that what you have researched actually does apply <laughs> and it does work out well. Yeah. And it's helped to reinforce the topics we've covered in class. It's very good, not just the dynamics unit, but also other units that we've done previously. We've carried those skills on into this unit. It's been really helpful like that. With being such a large project, um, there's so many components that do take time. Um, working together as a team definitely helps getting the presentation, the report and the boat's performance up to a really high standard. We all had our parts um, to do with the theory, construction, so yeah, we definitely had to work as a team. Yeah, we did a really good job of this and it probably shows that you've taken the time and put in the effort to produce a winning boat, which is really good.